I'm not with me no more there. Um, now nah, one part we people that we be now them don't say three or so to one. So I will introduce the team to one quick, and I will give Dr. Kamal the time for let he deliver in the session. Because I say no more, please. You in the session, I no go allow questions. We we'll mute everybody. Then after the session, we will give people enough time for let they ask questions. So I ask if anybody in my on mute at the moment, they are the big allow mute myself. So we will allow um, other people to play as well. Yeah. They are big. Let me mute myself, please. Let me mute my Thank you very much. Okay. Um, the company is to come out. Nayana, we, uh, Nayana, the team lead. You know, in anything we do, you can forget somebody when I lead. So, Dr. Kamara, the team lead. Um, I'm a consultant in emergency medicine and area of expertise. We give you general medicine advice. Please, yeah, me fan bold them la just say a word of caution. This show will not be placed on a GP or on a medical consultant. Then. No, we only there so for give on a medical advice. But like, if you notice something for yourself, you can even seek medical advice quick. Um, or if you if your doctor go tell you something but you don't understand, you can even ask to ask questions. If you don't ask an in general public, you can always send them to the email address where I will give on at the end. But here, let the person know everything they say now so now a one size fits all. No, they are big. Okay. So then, I'm Dr. Kamara. The next person, uh, Ms. Wugia to Kamara, we in a mental health nurse and a health visitor. In your area of expertise, we get for the take with you uh, in mental health. Now, like when I see normally, the panel, um, he, he vary. we get a lot of people with different experience in the, from different fields within the medical field. So if you ask questions, if you say you get questions, we're not even pertain to that subject, but you feel that something you want no but I can call you say to you, ask somebody within the panel, we will answer you. Okay. The next person we'll get now, Mr. Ibrahim, he say we're a qualified social worker and also a mental health advocate. So within this panel, now that day he will concentrate on and I will give advice on. Okay. The next person we'll get now, Ms. Fatima Kuruma, we're in now a new product development technologies and registered nutrition. He specialized in BAM nutrition. He didn't give a fantastic session before. If you go on YouTube, um, um, the material lady what will be recorded. Um, he also will give you another session next week now, you turn as well. I will circulate that, that, that information to everybody. Okay. And the next person we will get now, Ms. Isa Tashaka, who is a mental health nurse in the area of expertise and mental health. Like what I see, the people are in various experiences. So if you ask questions, one to the panel we will answer you. If there's something we need, maybe a one to one, maybe in, in, an in depth um, um, research, then we'll take them offline, we'll contact you offline. It's kind of okay. And last but not equally, um, Nami. I'm a name is John Fuller. I'm mean, a senior business consultant, and I'm the project manager this, this initiative, and also the host. And of course, I'm mean, in the PRO, the organization of the manifesto. Okay, so that are the team. So now I will can hand on over to the able doctor when I go present to me today. The I've been saying before, the I've been promised if I get any um, questions, suggestions, or feedback, because we want our feedback, we want suggestions from Mona. When I tell you, if there's something they will not do right, when I tell you, so we will improve. Also, if special subjects they will not go left for long, we talk about, when I tell you, because we know they are for tell on a normal for the country on a something, because something we do the plan for country on a not to really on a that, not to really on a one year. But there's a special area they want a one year, but when I tell you, we will try to prepare a message and come back to you. Dr. Kamar, I go hand, I go hand um, with people into that for their discussion. Uh, Thank you, sir. Thank you so much, uh, Mr. Piero, Mr. Wizard. <laughs> Thank you, Fambule uh, I want to take this opportunity to do a make an ask you now, although you know they permit talk, permit talk, so they are with people that we don't go down the way they are or down the way they are salon, they are low member them. Now, one minute silence, if they will take them and just remember them. Yeah. So, without uh, further ado, make we just do them, please. Thank you so much.
Thank you so much. We pray God say they and sold them all rest in peace. Thank you. So this talk here today, I will not talk one before the first session we talk about COVID in general. Uh, but today I say make we talk about this uh, cardiovascular disease in the COVID season. Uh, the reason why I say that people ask me baku baku question, then they will get heart problem, heart complaint, different different things they will go for do with the system. Mm -hmm. So I say I put them questionnaire together, compile them, and then answer them to the best of my ability. And of course, at the end of it all, you know, we are able for maybe field some question and answer session. So like everything we do, we always want to find out which in the system and which is they about and which in the problem the way could surround this system. So we always start with a definition and I try to make them as simple as possible. So the cardiovascular system, so man can call them blood vascular, so man can just call them the uh, circulatory system. The system where na in they make the blood pump na the body and then come back to the lungs from there, you go back to the heart. Um, if you obviously we don't describe it like I would do so, uh, obviously we need for no waiting make waiting at the makeup. Who's counting the way the panel? And of course, the heart, as we know, na muscle, na it make them up. Uh, and a, na pump. We as I say in main work na for pump blood na the body, but it make up na uh, the arteries, them, that's what they call them. The one day where they take the clean blood from the heart, from the left side of the heart, can go to the body, and then the vein, them, when then they take the bad blood or dirty blood from which side and don't walk in the body for come back to the lungs, them, for can get cleaned and then uh, go back into the heart, then go back uh, to, the, to the body again. Now, so constant circulation. But between the artery, them, that the left, and the vein, that the right, you get the small, small artery, them, and small, small vein, them. We side then come it up in the middle, and then call the capillaries. So the artery give rise to arterioles, when are the smaller one them, and then in the end, the smallest one then call them capillary, within at the artery side, and then the capillary then at the vein inside, come back to the venules, when are the smaller one then, then merge into the veins, and from the veins then come up to the lungs, when are they the oxygen, they, they come into the, 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 the blood, when are dirty blood or bad blood, and then the carbon dioxide now they breathe out, when are the one we will not need. Then you go back into the heart and then it circulate like that. So as you can see, I know more. Uh, the heart and the blood and the blood vessel, the way the artery, the vein, then the capillary, and they all they work for actually service the body. You know, it's like a network. As I, I explained, no more, I don't describe this. Now. So, so the, the clean one, them, when are the artery, then, then they give the clean blood. Uh, and then the, the, the carbon dioxide, when are the uh, end product of the thing that we eat and the breathing and all that they come out and come back to the heart via the, the, the lungs, you know. So when you breathe out, na, na dirty blood, you, 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 dirty oxygen, now you breathe out. And when you breathe in, obviously, na the clean one. So the tick then what we know, now then they provide uh, the, uh, uh, the, the thing that we, with oxygen, what we need for let we get the body for work for proper. So if you look at the system, you get the blood, you get the heart, you get the right side of the heart, and the left side of the heart. So the heart divide to the right and the left, and you get the up part and the bottom part. And of course, in them part, then you get the blood vessel them, which consist of the arteries, the veins, and the capillaries. And uh, as I said, then walk now for circulate oxygen and remove carbon dioxide, we're not the bad thing we will not need, because carbon dioxide now poison to the mortal man. If you get too much of them, it can unblock the brain and it can cause the person for lost consciousness and sometimes go into a coma. Apart from that, the body need the nutrients them, the thing that we need for make the body function proper. We need them call nutrients, but the only way the nutrients gonna go to the body, we will say we need them now through the blood, you know. And then of course, after the body don't work, the bad thing that we will not need the waste product, we get for take them out through the kidney and the liver, and of course through the lungs as well, you know. So by doing so. The, the body, they protect itself against infection and boku boku, boku, boku six, six next day. So uh, that's the main function where the heart and the circulatory system they do. But then again, the person cuts itself, inside that circulatory system that you get uh, what we call clotting factors that then they help for stop the bleeding. That makes some man we get bleeding disorder, we get problem with bleeding like the hemophiliac and all that. For people that we get uh, coagulopathy, they call them with the clotting system, not the walk they go bleed for a long, long time. But if the blood itself can stop the bleeding because it gets them clothing factor than they. Apart from that, 
we get hormone them that small small liquid substances that within the body where they have again for the metabolism like the one at the front of the neck now we then call the thyroid you know you can see people and get that gege uh now the thyroid down the way because they the function i make you see big so we drive and compensate so that day they produce hormone with thyroxine where they control the metabolism of the body you know we get the pancreas when they produce insulin you know and uh, and then glucagon so insulin and they help again for the metabolism of the carbohydrate then the sugar them who they eat you know and then of course you get the kidney now the kidney all man no say they pull the water the peas and all that but he also they produce uh, some substances one of them renin we are now responsible for the control of the blood pressure so you get boku boku na the body you know and then of course definitely um the uh, blood cells they help for regulate the, the temperature of the body we some man can feel warm now because the box then go na the blood then pump the poison na the blood and then the blood now they give message to the brain for tell you say ah problem there oh, you need for take paracetamol or take uh, codeine or take uh, ibuprofen you know or maybe go wash or something like that but that that the blood they do as well without that we not go over for no uh but who don't know about the normal uh, component parts them within at the makeup of the cardiovascular system if i let we know within at the main condition the way they affect the system now this not to the full uh, list it's not just some of the work but at the most important one the way i think say we need to know about uh, you get coronary artery disease like i've been talking this no more the heart na pump and a muscle you get you know a muscle again but this muscle they work for we but of course itself need something for for work for them so now like, when you catch me back i catch you and uh, the entity that they will they have this heart and call it the coronary artery they wrap around the heart so as we grow as we grow older or younger <laughs> you find out say um the before they eat the animal fat would they eat then they go block uh then small artery then they we can cause them for not for able for pump the blood to the heart muscle so i need them because if they walk they have to walk so that muscle later for uh, expect some nutrients and nutrients will come if the blood vessel uh, able for allow them for go if you not allow them now they this heart uh, chest pain they come out we they talk we then call angina and if you not able for control that then it can lead to a heart attack so coronary artery disease na thing we we for know about because we young people lend them more at risk than we compete with man them you know and of course i don't talk about heart attack and of course if you get a heart attack it possible say you could get irregular heartbeat we then call arrhythmia and of course if you get a heart attack it possible say the heart as a muscle as a pump will fail that then call heart failure and then of course so man can born with them but they don't know say they get them and then country yeah, every pick we born then they check them from the one straight away for no you know so most of them they can pick up that and they even from where the mama get the belly but na salon i don't know but we not get any cancer so so man we can just cut out young age you just dies until they play football you just cut out die possible say na then can defect the congenital heart defect we born with we not be know about you know and then of course added to that now that you will call cardiomyopathy it means the muscle of the heart no well is sick so you know able for perform the function of the pumping therefore it could begin big 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 and then in the end it cause problem for the heart and the lungs and then the person no go for live as long as you be able for the next one are peripheral artery disease that means the blood vessel that we did na the foot them na the hand them then self can get uh, you know sick you know especially people that we the, the, the smoke and people that we get problem then with the 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 leg like them like the varicose veins and all that then the blood that they come back up so if we go for go get clean therefore it cause problem and then the nutrients that they go to the skin and then the skin break down they get the ulcer on the leg and that it can lead one thing to the other so this not just a few of them why say lay a look into lad just telling us in so it but of course before you get sick you must know say you get some risk factor them now the risk factor them they divide to the one the way you able for control the yeah, artist then the way they under control and the one the way you know for control way now uncontrollable one them so amongst the one the way you know for control now one way they say you don't know, choose you know how you come to this world whether you come as a man or a woman so if you come as a man unfortunately if let me talk to runa we we have they at higher risk that we come we counter part the human them you know but that's just nature i can't do anything about that if i find like i'm as a uh, marian or something <laughs> but <laughs> but i name mohammed then of course the older you they get uh, the more likely say this fat could creep up na the vessel them and clearly go cause you more sick and if you get under the family like me say me get under the family you know me mama side uh, you know they all get hypertension so clearly you know are they at higher risk you know 
And of course, the new pandemic, the physical, they're not free well. No, by turn themselves stop for begin born begin, where we call menopause, and then say self don't equal to me now. So before uh, they get to that age where we day, where then they born begin, maybe at, at the age of uh, 18 to 50. By the time they reach to 55, clearly, most of the human they now don't they pass menopause. Well, then you now the risk self they multiply at that stage. And then of course, sadly, uh, this we condo black here, uh, 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 race war People away that Afro Caribbean, them clearly, you know, or Mexican or Hispanic, or we all they more at risk than we compete with man. Although they self get the new risk that we now for other sick them. But for them here, clearly we they more at risk. Um, and the one for control, well, they are very important. Well, let we know because the people within that the world there, so man go take up smoking. So then one day not smoke na tongue, but then he can have stress na job cause and for smoke. Two, smoking, we got to be careful with it. Tandy, as I say, they cause the peripheral vascular disease. They go and bug cousin. Again, the food what they eat. So Monday, if you don't put creature na in, na in, na in soup or na in uh, obiata <laughs> with the fufu Saturday, well, no, end no, up, no, 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 no. <laughs> you're in trouble. They have been. But of course, then they get animal fat. And as I say, they go up and up because we serve with a mortal man. We serve na animal. We get to you what we produce. We na the cholesterol. So if you imagine, say, we get to you, then the animal, you can add for we own, well, like that too. So no way you get for go up, and I make the taste is not to every day for eat beef. You know you can actually alternate them. You know, uh, and then of course, like I say, first we get blood pressure. Uh, thank God we live in a country that we at least we get access to the NHS to GP. The GP can give you tablet them we get for the take on a daily basis for let you control this blood pressure because the blood pressure can creep up on you. It can go up. You know it be no say don't go up, and then the next thing you realize the person going unconscious, also they get a stroke or you get a heart attack. So important for let we keep that under control. Again, we can't do that. Then place I will be saying for grab self or go out to the television. No problem. You get your remote now. You You just press up like that. You know, inactivity. You know, then job the whole just sit down no more. You know, we need for the actually move about because now only when you actually move about, the heart will begin pump, the muscle will begin pump, and then obviously it's better for you. You will even lose the weight and you will control the blood pressure and you will control the blood sugar. You know, because if you lose the weight. You could control the blood pressure and you could control the, the blood sugar, even though you get them, you know. And then, of course, we get for members say stress, a uh, big, big factor. You know, we've been going to our talk, we we'll talked about it two weeks ago. We'll talk about stress, anxiety, depression. We'll talk about that as well, you know. And then, of course, anger. But I say, even like them job, they would do so, they're good in the front line. Every day you don't attention, you know. So now, make some day you're fine for let you take time off, you come, you know, unwind recharge the batteries and go back to work, you know? Because otherwise, not that, you see? I rather talk about diabetes already. That is self nineteen we all know. It's a big, big, massive breakout where they now be country they now alone, the whole of Africa, you know? Uh, but then we will talk about that later. But clearly, even if you get diabetes, you can control them well. But if you don't control them well, clearly it will cause you a lot of problems, you see? Uh, and then, of course, the diet. We will not talk about that. We get a nutritionist. The diet, even in COVID, if you do eat properly, the kind for do, you get the, the thing that will give you a boost of your immune system. Clearly, you go improve and you go for protect yourself from getting this COVID. You know, again, the lockdown can cause people and for begin drink more than they're supposed to drink. I know they mean not to drink, but somehow they drink. Well, they like drink with measures because they say he is pleasure, he that drinks with measures. You know, but if they drink, at least, you know, moderate them because otherwise it will cause you problems as well. So I will just talk about the risk factors. I say the gender, hereditary, uh, age, the stress, inactivity, the smoking and the being overweight, and of course diabetes and the cholesterol and blood pressure. Uh, so as I say, what I do, I combine all them here. I say make I just uh, put them on the section. So the first section are the heart condition. The first question when the person asked me, he say if me get heart condition, uh, the risk of me contracting this sick or catching this sick or getting this sick, this COVID-19, be higher than somebody else with me own higher compared to the other person? Well, I could give you an answer and say no. You don't necessarily mean say because you get a uh, heart condition, it means say uh, you be at higher risk. Obviously, if you get heart condition where you don't know about, and then you put yourself more at risk, then clearly you would be at risk. But we don't know people that we get heart condition then we don't well. You know, they can get mild viral illness, then get a sore throat, then get a cough, then sneeze. So man get aches and pains, so man get temperature, but they're still well. Whereas a man, they will not get them at all, they actually end up dying. So it's a sickness in the way they call subclinical, which means you get them, 
but you know they produce any symptoms. And I don't think they worry about. And I make he sick, as I say, he indiscriminate. That's equal to the peak. Whether you poor, you gentry, you small, or you old, or you know, man, no, no, man, no, like that. So we go for just be careful, you know. I say up to five percent of people will get chest infection, then can visit and get this COVID, but that don't necessarily be seen a COVID they get. So if you look at the fact, say the old people and they're more likely to get this sick now because then get older sick than we on term we don't know about. But we know say as you go older, now so the sick than they are. We then call comorbidity, you see. So and so virus then they will get the like the common flu, it can come recurrent, i.e. If they, if they come, you know, two times, three times, four times, depending on which in the immune system, how it is, you know. Then, of course, somebody, yeah, somebody asked me this question. They say, uh, the risk of uh, contracting this COVID-19, if not the same for everybody uh, with the condition or differences than they, well, for let you actually uh, contract this illness, it gets to be equal for everybody. Because what you do, if like I get heart condition and the other person not get them, but if I didn't a person where they sneeze, they cough, you know, and he get them and they talk to me, no, no, say he get them, but they talk to me, the droplets where they come out now the person in mouth, in nose, now in the, the transfer to me, we go cause me for catch this sickness. So obviously, uh, if the sickness begin, then I don't look after me. So if I get heart condition, then definitely I get more at risk. And so I go suffer more than person will not get that, you know, because what you do, if you touch place with this virus day, whether you get heart condition or not, I don't think it's important. The important thing is, if you go wash your hands, whether you get heart condition or not, clearly uh, you stand a better chance of killing this virus because you use soap water, warm water, and you wash your hands for 20 seconds. Because what you do, this virus gets three part panam. One part they will get uh, uh, oil panam. And oil, as you know, they mix with water and soap. So as, you, as long as you don't put the water and soap in a warm water, you go pull the virus, kill them, and that way, you stand a better chance of not catching it. It's as simple as that, you know? But any virus will go inside the system, it affect the system in two ways. Especially this one, where they affect the lungs. So they go into the lungs, and obviously, because they affect the lungs, the chance for let you breathe proper, naive, they actually obstruct. So therefore, the oxygen level in the blood, they go down. We go cause you for lose your ability for be conscious, I mean, you know, they're awake. And then the other part is that because now, inflammatory process with the infection, they actually bring the blood pressure down. And if you bring the blood pressure down, the heart gets a bit faster for let it make up for the amount we you not get from, from the, the, the pressure. And that's how it works. Now make you see, they say, people that will get heart trouble, people that will get other condition, they're definitely they're more at risk. But everybody get equal risk and all you get for doing is for protect yourself the best way you can. And then the next one, they ask me, say, uh, la name the people that were no say, the group that were no say, they more at risk. Well, I say, okay, the people in way, don't get transplanted in their life, they're not transplanted like the kidney, the heart, the lung, then they're more at risk because what you do, then they take drugs them for prevent, for let the, the, the organ with them transplant nor reject itself from the body. Because remember, now other person in body is the pull up. And so that person in body, he gets in your makeup. If I'm bringing can't can put them for me, the body now make up, nobody recognize them. Therefore, I need to get something for stop this. It block my own senses for accept this, 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 uh, 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 organ with them transplant now that go make uh, it go left by me and then it go work for me otherwise it go stop so them kind of people and then they're at risk definitely people that will get cancer we don't do chemotherapy radiotherapy then they're at risk obviously people that will get blood cancer leukemia lymphoma people that will get heart disease obviously then they are at risk the older people them frail one them woman them will get better unfortunately you know um people that will get heart failure people who talk about cardiomyopathy you know people that will get uh, Irregular heartbeat, you know, all into the people who get pacemaker, then they're all day at higher risk uh, than uh, other people. Then. But one thing what we know is that people that we get valve, then artificial valve, then with a metal valve, they're not there at any more risk. And we don't know, say, because of the valve, you get that you would call the risk of endocarditis, which means the inside of the heart can get infected. But then people and they're not there at any higher risk than we will not get them at all. So that, that for let people know about that number. But then kind of, uh, people that are done list so then they obviously more at risk. Now make them now deal for shield or protect themselves as best as possible. Somebody tell me say in get this particular uh, sickness we don't call atrial fibrillation with na uh, irregular heartbeat. As you know, the heart beat boop boop. But so Monday you know heart beat boop 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 boop. So when that happened, 
obviously the blood let the flow like it's supposed to flow and that means the blood will begin uh, store will begin pool it like like where it begins store and when you store you know see where blood not flow it will congeal it will turn clot and if you get clot then as the day the lung they go and bog the oxygen will for take place the oxygenation will for take place by the lung if not the heart it will cause the heart not for beat if not the leg it will cause uh, what we call thrombosis you know a different thrombosis when a clot so obviously it fine for make the blood the flow now you make then people yeah if you find out they're always there on something for thin the blood when I like uh, aspirin or clopidogrel or uh, tachygrel or the other thing but as long as the blood thin it will flow better but obviously with that you get another risk where if you bleed you cut yourself you can bleed a lot more than somebody who's not there on that now make you see we can protect them for letting off for them and bang their head because it can cause a lot of problems if they're there on them blood thin as they bleed you know and then people and they obviously they're more advised to make them take the most protective measures you know observe the social distancing put the mask on where then they go away if you can go in a public transport or go in any confined space you know they need to get their mask and done because what you do you don't know who that they near you whether i get this thing or not and if they talk to you this thing they come out if person sneeze by you and cough by you they say i'm you know but as long as you not sneeze and cough it just they talk to you until they come on i much you know they say i'm and if you learn that you know you know see there or in your face then you you know the thing begin going from the nose now into the back of the throat it will do for like two three days begin multiply from there now if any way to the lungs and by then now so then they are already going to the lungs uh, not too much for let the body handle that's when the problems happen you see so if you observe the social distances you put the mask on you wash your hands as regularly as possible and not touch your face clearly well you're more protected than anybody else with it one so somebody else let me say indoor reads say this covid 19 they cause heart problem like heart attack or arrhythmia well as i say the a, a possible thing will cause that i know somebody will die now with yourself with and say you get covid so man they say oh no no covid and a heart attack killer but of course the 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 the, the virus they can at the body it they cause inflammation and that inflammation they can actually attack them blood vessels they have been talking about with a plaque dip and with that covering dip and that, uh, that fat when you cut them, you can actually, if you come out cut, you can go and go block the blood supply to the heart. Therefore, if you don't get the blood supply at the heart, which are needed, well, like that, you can bring your angina. If angina not get resolved, then clearly you can get a heart attack. It's as simple as that. So not to say that directly, but indirectly because of the lack of the blood supply, because of the plaque, because of the fat in the, in the blood vessel, you can get a heart attack, you know. Uh, and of course, uh, the, the virus can worsen somebody we get it can make the thing worse. It can make it be bad than I've been there. So if you don't get the heart condition, it can worsen up. You know? But all you get for do and for prevent dentin and as best you can really. So somebody else asked the same question, say, uh, in don't they among people away listen a cardiac patient then? And then, then then get diabetes and then get hypertension. If then they are at higher risk. Well, as it is now, the worst combination that you could get. Somebody will get heart complaint. Somebody will get diabetes and at the same time you get hypertension. Uh, from the data we will receive from China, when did this thing begin, uh, obviously uh, uh, the people that we survive this thing, most of them, uh, now older people and they were new day, the, uh, was it? The, the people that we died from this thing, most of them are in the 70s and above. The younger ones then they will for survive. But clearly, even the younger ones then, if they get other sickness that we not possibly know about, the person to say then they are at risk more so clearly so when they do the post-mortem them they find out say then fan or that in them we not necessarily that because of just the covid now make you see the older people in the diet now make them say now for protect them and make them shield so if you know say they in the higher risk category then i for shield yourself and protect yourself if you're symptomatic then isolate you know and if you did for seven days you isolate clearly you feel better then that's all right but if you know they feel better they monitor how you feel and then clearly you get one 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 way go ring or any of the public uh, 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 public uh, 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 depending on the country where they whether na, na one nine one one or one 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 will ring the emergency services now then now go actually uh, send ambulance for you for letting can take you care of you assess you you know uh, so my mean they say if you take uh, then anti hypertensive then see, then tablet when they give for blood pressure when uh, uh, lisinopril they call the ACE inhibitor. Uh, when uh, angiotensin converting enzyme uh, inhibitors, one of them is lisinopril, so mango don't hear about that. Enalapril, captopril, perindopril, quinalapril. 
All lending aid, I mean, say if somebody they take them in, they are at higher risk. Well, as far as we know, no document, no deal, don't confirm that say that's what it be. But I, one thing I can tell you now, even if that's what it be, you're always better off for continue for taking your tablets and not for take them. Because COVID in mortality rate, in death rate, people will go die from uh, now two to three percent. So most of the people and we get that sick, they go survive. No questions about that. We don't get over seven and a half million in the world. So far, we don't even get up to 400,000 who don't die. It just goes to show you. Some other sickness, and then we get higher mortality. So if you this day you get a two to three percent, clearly you well advise, say, make you take your tablet them because you get more benefit for taking your tablet them than for beginning what is saying if you take your tablet them because you already at higher risk of the COVID. Especially the one that we get blood pressure and diabetes as well. And somebody I say um, the COVID-19 can, can make sure, can actually trigger uh, myocarditis and pericarditis infection of muscle of the heart and then pericarditis the inflammation of the cover where the muscle gets. So you get pericardium, you get myocardium and you get endocardium. So pericardium that the cover, myocardium that the muscle and endocardium that the inside of the heart. So then they ask whether if you don't get um, the, if you don't get this sickness here, it's possible to say you go able to contract uh, this uh, sick again, i.e. you will actually induce uh, the, the myocarditis or the pericarditis. Well, no evidence that no day for confirm. Say anybody will be not get pericarditis and pericarditis, they are at higher risk for get this complication uh, by the fact that you don't catch uh, COVID-19. You know, obviously, we get some sick then the way they come in, in a, like a relapsing method. They go in and out. So relapse, remission, relapse, it get better and then it get bad. But then can sick then they obviously, it's possible to say you go affect the heart in some way and cause problems. But in itself, as we know, uh, myocarditis and pericarditis not means that you're more vulnerable, you're more at risk to catch uh, COVID-19 than the person who not get that. Some people ask, say, if you get heart disease, you're likely to die of COVID-19 than compared to person who may not get them. But so far, the thing that we will know, now old age and of course underlying condition, like heart condition, and then they increase the risk of the person for let he die from this. But as I say, that said, you get people and we get this guy sick, but they still survive. So the vast majority can survive. You know, it just depends on how this thing is gone. You know, but uh, if you look at the, the, the last line from this thing, look at it, COVID now three to 4%. Ebola, we will know about now, West Africa, especially Salon and Guinea and Liberia, can, up to 60% can die. So out of every 100, up to 60 can die. But look at this now, three to four number can die. If you look at the other one where they come out from the Middle East, Saudi Arabia, Qatar, Kuwait, and all that, 35 percent, that ain't bad pass even this one. And then of course the other will be common at the same area in China a few years ago, SARS, look at 10 percent. So you can imagine this one are three to four, and the one within here I'm not 10. The rest of them now they're in double digits and all that. So it just goes to say, say a lot of people in wicked this sick, uh, they will survive. No questions about that. So somebody that asked me, say, you know, say, then don't tell and say, no go hospital. Rain at the advice will be people and say, if you know, say, you okay, I will manage your host, then no go hospital. You know, uh, it asks whether if for seek medical advice, if he get a precondition. I mean, that means you don't get some sickness when on the line one. You know, uh, as I say, if you think, say, you get the COVID, then you need to be uh, sincere to yourself. You need to be truthful to yourself and say, hang on. I can manage their, their symptoms they are now also or not. This uh, head that, the temperature, the pain, uh, the coughing and sneezing and all that. If I will manage that with paracetamol, good food, good rest, then perhaps I don't need to go hospital. But however, I need you to understand, say, if you're not comfortable for manage yourself, then please, 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 you know, no day now host, try for seek help. 111, 911 or 999 or whatever, and you get, they're all then there for assist you. So mommy say if you take uh, ibuprofen with a non-steroidal anti-inflammatory, instead they make you more at risk. That not possible. We not get for prove that at all. There's no proof to support that evidence at all. So I'd rather you take the ibuprofen and feel better than not take them because you feel say you're at risk. Because the temperature can actually cause you more problems. It can actually make you go into seizures. It can get, make you get fit. You get up to 39, 40. And so sickness then they 
if you get up to 39, it can make them worse, and that can even kill you sooner rather than the, the COVID-19. So my advice to you, if you take ACE inhibitor, you best take them than you not take them. Again, if you take uh, ibuprofen, you best take them than not take them at all. For the next uh, group, we will put on uh, actually staying safe. So again, the people ask me, say, uh, any additional measures that they will them for take? I then go for take any kind, uh, uh, you know, measures for let them able for uh, stop the sickness for go further. Now, of course, depending on the country where you day, I always advise people and follow the advice of the country, the health authorities of the country you are you day. They might be different, like in different one from the other because of the uh, the local guidelines and the local protocol then. But at the end of the day, they all get more or less the same. No more some country they get this thing that so we need for, for follow that. And um, we need for be sincere with yourself. We need to be truthful that if we get conditioned the way we know say the Ambogui, then clearly we need for be truthful say we need for reduce the infection. And the only way for do that is to follow the advice. You understand? So if you're sick, you better let you wear a mask. If the person where they care for you, they around you in self lay wear a mask. Like maybe they go to hospital, they may not get the sick, but while they go for go see the patient, any patient where I go for go see, I must put my glove on, I must put me the mask on, I must put me the, the, the plastic apron on. Simple as that. If I go in a person where I know I go for go put tube in my throat, I could dress like where I did in the moon. You know, the moon man dress, right? And the PPE. And it's very important because this sick, a droplet, now where you go put something in a person's throat, with the person they cough and all that, and come and face, and you don't know about that, you know. And remember, the two meter distance, you know, that social distancing or you know preventative distancing, very very important. Uh, so monkey argue now say well hang on, the, all the rest of the world then are one meter, uh, but we now they say two meter. Well, according to England, now two meter they say, and we can only abide by within the rules of England. That if at all now other countries then they say one meter, they follow that. It better for let you day one meter or two meter apart than you know they. Uh, apart at all. I know say it's stronger for people in a salon because they get for the antimod, they go for the market in a crowded area. But even so, when a day near and near, if you get that mask now your face, it will prevent you from a lot of things. And the mask, you know, necessarily means that you get for get mask going at the one way, then they make them push one. No, that's sure the people in the put that they hate. If you actually put them now you mot, now you know, and cover, as simple as that, that don't do enough for you for preventing from anything. You see, if you're able to avoid for jump in a crowded place, then fine. Be able to avoid for go na uh, motor car or put a put a wake up people and I can advise people and for lead and try and minimize that. You know, the Lord and they say people and for the one meter, two meter apart, but not all man they abide by that. But even so, if you get the mask, really a, a lot better for you, safer for you. Remember, for wash their hand there yeah, and get the happy birthday song if you sing that twice, but I take the done twice with one more time. So clearly, if you don't do enough for prevent the sick, you know. And of course, if you cough, remember. Cover your mouth and uh, with the tissue, when you sneeze and cough on them, no, put them inside, put them at the bin, you know, and make sure so you don't touch your face. If you cough, you don't get tissue, then cough now your elbow, you know, inside your elbow, you know, rather than cough now your hand. You can sneeze as well, like that, you know. And uh, if you go go shop, remember, uh, when you go shop, you get in a public, if you wear a mask, when you come back, uh, that mask day, you get for full them in a special way because otherwise you get yourself infected. Especially if the person don't get the tea, you didn't find the mask. If you go touch the front rather than pull them from the back, well, to turn as well, you get infected. So you go, if you come in, carry your products them or whatever you don't buy, go in at the tap day, wash with your able, and then wash your hands then. After you wash your hands, you dry your hands, then obviously you know say now you're ready for that you join the family. It's quite important. As I say, some man say this sick na 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 woman sick, you know, like man, uh, because what you do. They put that they say you know for touch you 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 mouth, you know for touch you eye and you know for touch your nose. When you combine them three letters they are M E N when a man and the other way for prevent them, na W O M E N. I mean some man they say this is now woman sick, you know, like man, but that's not just the joke inside of it. But clearly if you touch your face less, you know, I the mouth, the nose and the eye, it definitely will reduce. And in fact, another advisor than you, now for way the open door, either motocado or donor os and all that. Use the hand way now you know they use most of the time. So if you're not right hand man, use your left hand. If you're not left hand man, use your right hand. Simple as that. Because what you do, if you feel for crack your face or people rub your eye or rub your nose, clearly the hand way now you they use, now you like it for you than the one way not use. So if you now you use your hand way not they use, it's easy for let you say, yeah, clearly I'm not going to infect this because clearly now the one way not get to use, now you get the, the virus. 
So again, you know, clean your hand, wash your hand, the door knob them, you know, make sure we touch them, you know how to wash your hand them, you know. And of course, stay home as much as possible. If you don't get nothing for do na do outside, you know, for go na treat, you know, say a two bodo, because the other thing they need for do, stay in the house. And of course, remember, exercise is very important. In fact, I get a video we go show we which the exercise will get even just indoors. It's very effective and it help you even better than for going to the gym. As it is now, the gym they unlock. You know, um, definitely if you get temperature, try for maintain them. You know, by taking regular paracetamol and ibuprofen. Ibuprofen na uh, eight hours, so every, two every eight hours paracetamol, two every four to six hours. So they are ibuprofen na uh, three times a day in every twenty-four hour, and uh, paracetamol uh, uh, four times a day in every twenty-four hours. You know, and as I say, follow the law them of the country which are you there. You know, obviously the people are more at risk than supposed for shield, they're supposed for dinner house as best as possible. That no means because you didn't house, you know for go work and you backyard, you know for go work and you got it, no, you know for go and the block go speak you like no, you can still do that. No question, as long as you get your mask, go you the outside. But then the last thing we'll for do that now the government work now for track the people them like people when they come out abroad camp, you get for track them, you get that inventory. You know, that itinerary, who started them come out, their name and all that. And then you trace them because this is, if you come out here now, uh, you go uh, through Denmark or through Morocco, from there to Salon, and then now uh, you come down, maybe you spend two hours at the cafe, from there you go free town. Well, if you get the sick, all the people that we come in contact with, na, na the, na the Morocco or Denmark, where you come down, they potentially don't get that sick the way you did it. So, therefore, a nice for that we trace them, and then of course, we get for aggressively test them. Now, the test again, another problem. Because the test, some man they get false positive, some man they get false negative. Now, some man now wait and tell and say you're negative, you go gladly. Whereas, sometimes the place where they go do the test in front of the nose, the virus not in the at the back of the nose. Now, make you see they go for doing from the back of the nose. Again, the throat as well. Plus, if the person, the time where you go do the test, now the very first day where you catch the sick, the possible say the viral load, the amount of virus in the body, you know enough for life, then go do the test, it come out positive. Again, if the person don't they don't get a six, seven days, at the time you go test them, so until they are the tail end, the tail with the thing don't dump and so when you test them now, we're negative. But the only test one I know say will be definitely 100 percent guaranteed is that blood test, we then call antibody test. Because the antibody, you know, go ever get a pass if you say you don't get this sick, don't come to your body where you come in the form of an antigen. And when you come inside your body, if for the day for a certain period of time, so that the body go uh, fight against them. And when you fight against them, it, they develop this antibody. So now you get an antigen antibody complex where now you will look for when you look at the blood. So if person get that, that means this person could don't get some amount of immunity against any kind of infection way now of the same one in the future. Like me now, they talk to me so because I didn't at the front line, I get my own test done on Monday. And uh, alhamdulillah, uh, Tuesday, then phone and send me a text saying my blood test come back as negative. But me now, they begin thinking, well, hang on, which I don't do, because I do it around people. Most of the colleagues, then, so they will get them. You know, how me not get them? Now, as I say, either it means say, my immune system really good, or it means say, the viral load will come across very low, or something I don't get them at all because of the preventive measures what they take. And now, they worry me, say, which I will do now for make I continue for stay safe, because me now, no, still not get immunity. So the person that we don't get, we then get positive antibodies, then at least get some immunity. So somebody has say, he may get the flu and he don't take uh, the vaccine, that is the maclate for the pneumonia and the flu. Uh, if they ask if you get protection against the virus, well, the simple answer is no, because the virus, we, they cause the flu, not to the same as the virus we, they cause this COVID-19. And again, pneumonia, although they get viral pneumonia, but mostly, a bacteria, man, because I'm so if you take the vaccine, you take the maclate, then clearly, not necessarily, you say you're protected or you actually know what COVID 19. As simple as that. Uh, somebody they ask again if I for wear a mask or protect myself, but well, I don't talk, I'm repeated that I say the mask is very important and not to because you just need to protect yourself, but you protect the people away there around you as well. If you know, say you get symptoms, you for wear up. If they come out, go in a crowd, you for wear up. If you go in a place where confined, we not get wind and all that. People wear up, you know. So we, as I say, we always do wear up. The whole of the department, the whole of the hospital, everybody, whether it be patient or doctor or clinician, everybody they wear a mask now because, as I say, you don't know that getter. So therefore, for prevent you for getter, you need for 
uh, well I'm, and for prevent you will get time for the and to the patient or the patient here and to the for well. And that's not the only way we will go develop this thing call herd immunity. The only way to do when the men then cow and sheep, then go notice they by herd. You know, then we're in a good place, then they know that, you know, because you just have the, you know, shepherd, and that's it. So herd immunity, which means you go for don't get 60% of the population, we go don't get the sick, for let you get some amount of immunity so that the sick go day low. But for that to happen, a lot of lives go go. Now that they won't try for us, but it don't work because they miss the opportunity for lock the country. So, and somebody they asked, but these are very, very important and I'm glad you really person asked them. He said, I can take vitamin or food supplement. And if so, who's one them for take for protect me? Then go protect me from COVID-19. Well, so far, me and you, where they are, I can tell you now, say, then don't find out, say, the BAME community, that is the black and ethnic minority uh, community, then don't find out, say, we get either moderate or low vitamin D. And vitamin D, as we all know, now from the sun, now they get, as you know, then places I will not get much sun. So we get eight months of rain and, you know, and snow and all that. And then maybe we get one month or two months of, 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 of the sun. So because we body, we skin get melanin, and this melanin, now they determine how the complexion is. So my way yellow, it get less. So my way dark, it get more. So the darker the complexion, the more the possible, say, these uh, rays of the sunshine, let they enter the body for produce this vitamin D. Therefore, they advise every black man to take vitamin D supplement. Me say we talk to now, and they take them every every blessed day. I will take one vitamin D supplement. So I go advise you strongly for begin take them. If you are not take already, you know. Uh, they talk about this hydroxychloroquine or quinoline and all that antivirals. They all they say, but we don't say hydroxychloroquine. Now one way get for do with malaria and uh, uh, lupus. You know, leprosy. No, com no convincing evidence. Yeah, yeah. Okay. You know, this do, <laughs> this do men, anybody, you know. So clearly, I advise you not to take that at all. Antiretrovirals, then they definitely have more to do uh, with uh, people that will get HIV. So, in the menu at all, you know. So, uh, vitamin D, very important, of course. Food, you know, uh, diet way rich in fresh vegetables and fruit is always recommended. And in fact, it better than to go begin to do uh, vitamins. So if you get them naturally, that's very good. So we don't get one uh, talk on nutrition in COVID. So it's a very important. And inside will confirm saying, indeed, this is not true. So we eat fruit, we, 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 we stress less, you know, less anxiety, and of course we sleep well. We don't get another talk about sleep as well. Sleep disorders, how you go impact on uh, the possibility say you could catch COVID. So all that thing that they definitely go happen, but vitamin D, do you have many people left? I know we stress enough, it's very important for well, uh, we begin to care. There. So, uh, as I said, some people, and they will get some low, and therefore, uh, they're supposed to take out. Now, you go say, well, make I go get a blood test to me, doctor. Well, then this one thing will take two, three weeks. And in that time, you never know. So, I go advise you, if you're able to buy them, at the counter, buy them and begin using them, please. It's very, very important, you know. But, however, when you take them, remember, say, then get limit to, some man go say, if they say, make I take one, let take two, let take four. If you overdose them, insert that in your own effect. Oh. So, no go beyond the amount where they say for take. So, now one tablet they say for take, we are, we just maintain that in a one for take rather than you go take two or four. You know, I know people are making drive and say, well, I tell you what, if I take four, so tell me, go better for me and you go sooner. No, it doesn't work now because any of them tablets, they can get their risk and they get their side effects. So, important for making members say, take what they recommend for you. If you get any queries, ask your doctor. You know, Aha, the question I've been talking about before. Somebody asked me, say, if I can catch COVID more than once, if I don't get some now, I get immunity. I go, well, we know, say, this sick, now you sick. Nobody will tell you, say, we know, say, uh, if you don't catch your one thing, you don't go catch your you know. However, we get uh, experience from the other one that we don't deal with before. You know, the SARS, the MERS. We know, say, if you catch them, definitely when you recover, you get some amount of immunity. And normally, according to the statistics, you get at least six to 12 months immunity. So if that's not the case for this one, then likely say, you know, it will repeat itself and the other viruses, they let me know. And um, the only that we will give you immunity, now obviously, if you get the vaccine. Now, as we all know, the vaccine, no day, not available yet, but now, now, research, they go on, and hopefully, within the next 12 to 18 months, we'll go down get that. In the meantime, all we get for do now, for do which we will for do, uh, protecting ourselves and co co complying with the measures we don't 
uh, tell me about we will for you know uh, as i said the vaccine very important but it's not going to be available now so medication them now the other uh, part we will talk about um the person asked me say whether you need for change in heart condition and the doses them again i will not talk about this the ACE inhibitors them when they have the blood pressure you know by so all when they beta blocker and all that clearly i always tell people and say you're better off taking your tablets than not take them because you depend for covid if you get any query any questions please 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 talk to your doctor i'm sure he will advise you accordingly but as far as we know not stop for taking medication because you're better off alive with your medication than you know uh, with, with you with the medication than you go end up die without your medication and then uh, get COVID. I think say, that may be wrong uh, uh, priority, Dandy. So please, please take your medication as standard. You know, no proof, no they say because if you take them, that means you are more at risk. You know, as well, just, just, uh, take all the medication as they prescribe them. And that's it. If you doubt, talk to your doctor. Somebody has say report that don't can say uh, medication the way they give, tablet the way they give to people that get COVID, they can cause dangerous arrhythmia. That means they had to begin go you know, bazaar. Well, what I need for no. Well, people and they will get sickness, then I can really talk. Somebody go just cut out at the age of 10, 15, just cut out, they play football, he said, cut out to die. We know. I know one name, name, but footballer themselves would be their heart to not stop in the field. They know because they get them sick here, you know, because they're born with them and, you know, in a small thing, they not being that bad. But they begin to stress their heart and the heart give in. So, if you get their heart condition, the impossible say this can cause that. But if you did feel unwell, as I said, now you're supposed to be very, very genuine to yourself and very, you know, uh, I would say, uh, uh, truthful to yourself. If you did feel bad, no begin to say, not for coming to the hospital. Because we don't know to say, the first two weeks where they declare the lockdown, half of the people who will be in the country week, then they really get angina, then they really get stroke, then they really get asthma, they get heart attack, and all that, they all stop for coming because in the future, they tell them, say, if they can come to the hospital, when and that, they can't catch uh, COVID. No, it doesn't work like that. If you get cancer, you get sick, then they and general, this and that. Please, please, please monitor them. If you know they respond to the treatment, being 111 or 911 and come, then we'll bring you come and we'll go assess you. Because all the hospitals, they now divide. So the one day we get COVID and the one day we don't get COVID. So if you come clearly, if you don't get COVID, then we'll put you at this week, the COVID Monday, and we'll treat you. You know? But remember, if you come to hospital, I advise you now strongly do that. We're going to bring the most up to date prescription. The reason why I say that, that because if you get the prescription way they up to date, it will help the doctor. It will help the doctor when he treat you. So at least the doctor know what he forgive you and what he not forgive you. If you not do that, then obviously you left you, yourself at the mercy of that doctor. Did. Because by the time you go for good get for find out what happened, concern at 7, 8 o'clock, the doctor that told you they don't lock, you there in the problem. So I advise you now, if you go to hospital, get that up to date prescription. It's very important. And then the next uh, item where we actually combine them, now, how you for stay safe outdoors? We will not talk on this. The person asks, if I safe outside, provided I avoid crowded areas, but you don't ask the question, that's it. Example, I can go go work outside. Indeed, if you're in Barack Obama, yes, we can. It's as simple as that. You know, uh, the virus, you know, uh, 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 no go, no go kind of your body because between you, you day outside, they breathe pressure. No. Now, when somebody then yeah, you will get a way to talk to you, you will get that droplet or cough or sneeze, then you will get a. But you need for remember, say, you need to avoid people that we know well. You need to avoid crowd. You know, need to avoid confined places, then, you know. And then they go help you at all. And of course, you need to keep according to the rules that we then, then give you in the country where you live. It's very important that. But that social distancing, absolutely superb. You get for follow that. That mask, absolutely, 100%, you get for follow that. You know, wash your hands. As regular, and if you know well, monitor that. If needs be, well, one, one, one. So, but definitely, someone asked me again if I can travel or use public travel. Well, of course, you can do that. If you don't get alternative means of transport, you're able to take taxi, you're able to take any other one, then by all means, you can do that. But remember, you go for protect yourself. Then get guidelines, them that in different, different country, them, so you need to follow them. But I can always say, if you get no option than for travel in a public transport, like the underground, like the bus, them, and all that, even the taxi them, remember, forget your face mask on. You know, remember for touch less of them till then there. When you can, remember when you turn back, the mask pull them at the proper way and dispose of them and put them at the place where it's supposed to be. Because if possible, we will go touch them and get infected. And then you go for dinner in that place. Then, of course, how you pull them, very important. 
so that you don't get yourself infected. But wash your hands as you're supposed to. It's as simple as that, you know? 20 seconds, that happy birthday song. Sing that twice, that don't do for 20 seconds. All right, staying well. Now the other section, that. How you for stay well? Hello. Well, I want you now for listening to this, please. We're all adults socially isolating at the moment. But it's especially relevant to older adults whose immune system isn't in tip-top shape. What I'm going to tell you is information of how to keep your immune system strong to help you fight the coronavirus. I'm Professor Janet Lord, and I'm the director of the Institute of Inflammation and Aging at the University of Birmingham. And for the last 20 years, I've been investigating how the immune system changes with age, makes you less able to fight infections, but more importantly, what you can do about it and how your lifestyle can help you to keep a strong immune system. The good news is that you don't need to go down the gym to do these exercises. You can't anyway at the moment. You don't need any special equipment. Everything you need is in your own home. Let's look at these exercises now. The first thing is to warm up. What you can start with is just 10 simple heel raises. From this, you can go on to then 10 side leg raises. Do 10 with your left leg and 10 with your right leg. The next exercise is a leg strengthening exercise. Simply take a chair, this could be a garden bench or a chair in your home, sit in the chair and rise out of the chair. Try not to use the arms if you can. Try to do this again 10 times. One of the surprising things that my research has revealed is that your immune system is helped by your muscles. Muscles make special hormones called myokines, which help your immune system to find the infection in the first place, but they also make sure that the inflammation that results from this doesn't get out of hand. And that's really important when you're fighting viruses like coronavirus. The last exercise is to strengthen your arms. What you can do is take two weights in either arm. This could be a tin of beans or whatever it's around and simply raise your arms up and down 10 times. Now we've done the strengthening exercises, we can go on to the last exercise which is going up and down stairs. This may surprise you, but this is a fantastic exercise. You get aerobic exercise, getting your lungs and your heart working, but you also get leg strengthening going up the stairs. Go up and down as many times as you can. If you can only do two to three to times to start with, that's fine, but try and build up to 10 times. If you live in a bungalow or you're in a flat, you might have some stairs outside that you can use. Again, just go up and down the stairs as many times as you can. It's an amazing exercise. The last message is that during your trip out, your single trip out, try to get those 10,000 steps in. Our research has shown that if you can do that, your immune system and particularly the immune cells that have to fight the infection as your front guard are strengthened by this. But the important thing, I think the final summing up message is please don't sit down for long periods of time. Social isolation doesn't mean you have to change into a couch potato. Being sedentary is equally bad for your immune system. Sitting is the new smoking. Many of the exercises I've shown you today are also used by physical activity providers, such as Move It or Lose It. As their classes now can't run because of social isolation re uh, regulations, They've also got online versions of these classes. Please go and check them out. I'm sure you'll enjoy them. I hope these tips were helpful for you. And perhaps also you can pass them on to your friends and relatives who may be struggling at this time to know what to do to keep themselves fit and particularly to boost their immune system. Thank you. I'm Professor Janet Lord from the University of Birmingham. So again, I also know I enjoyed that video there, but I get a lot of information, a lot of tips, how for get active and get for continuing for, you know, uh, stay fit as well as improve the immune system. Somebody say in the feel anxious, we did not talk about anxiety disorder uh, a couple of weeks ago. Anything you can do for feel better? Well, of course, if you're anxious and not to you want, all man anxious because some man did not use for dinner or some man no use for dinner, we wrap them and demand them and all that. It creates that thing. In fact, we don't see 25% increase in the domestic violence because of this uh, lockdown, you know? But of course, if you eat, you know, you get in them for do, for take your mind, or, you know, away from things for reduce the anxiety, you know, you eat well, you know, again, as I say, nutrition, we don't talk about it. You eat regularly, you eat healthily, clearly, you know, keep your body strength up, rest as best you can, get the vitamins, them, get the minerals, them. Uh, then they go help you for combat your anxiety. Some food, then the way you go eat, like some yogurt, some grains, 
and vegetables, you know, and all of that to help you for, you know, handle your anxiety levels, no questions about that. Remember though, so mango begin indulge, so mango begins a lie, eat cake and biscuit and all that. It's sweet though, but uh, it's it not good for the body as well. If you eat, but so just, you know, a little amount of that. You know, again, the extra sugar, as we know, not good for anxiety at all, because if you na comra, you will definitely agree with me, say, and for the beginner, but take that song kiss no more. <laughs> not drink really well like that. You don't talk to Allah. <laughs> then go there up and down and do all kinds of things, you know. So, and again, alcohol, sir. So you able please minimize and keep to a minimum. Or drink plenty of water, nice cup of tea, coffee, in a quiet place. Surprisingly, go able for help you for, for your anxiety. Um, exercise, again, absolutely, that we don't talk about. You know, you can still use your, you know, social distancing and all that. You still do that. You can FaceTime your brother or sister. You know, take time. Somebody will not talk to you. Take somebody will not pull. You will not be the talk and this that. Pick the phone. Be the bigger person. Talk to them. You know, Skype them. You know, you never know. That might just be the way to make the difference and then things will start going. You know, and kind of listen to music. You know, listen to something where you do some DIY. Learn a new language. Learn a new trick. You know, things like that. It will reduce your anxiety. No one. No questions about that. Uh, stay busy, you know, with your chores. Like me, I left for play Scrabble, I get for, I get for play then, like nineteen the way uh, they, 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 they task me brain, they really challenge me brain, you know, standing around a good thing. But, but don't just look at the TV, you always get negative, negative, negative. Number of people who they die, who's kind, people who they kill, and this and all that. Take your mind away because definitely not good for the soul. So look, look at something with different, you know, read a book, do a crossword, do some crochet knitting, so if you can. And all that, then they will help you definitely for reduce your tension and anxiety. You know, avoid excessive negative messaging. We talk about that. And of course, the breathing exercise. Now, I get one video, we get for doing breathing, but people, at one time, I can post that later. So it's really helpful for get you breathing in order and control so that the anxiety levels will actually calm down before you go for live a normal life. You know? Yeah. So, now that number I get for when I'm a family. Thank you so much for listening to me. And any questions when I get, I, I'm more than happy for answer to the best of my ability. Thank you very much, Dr. Kamara. Um, I hope you will all do enjoy um, this session. We all learn a lot about if we get underlying conditions um, during this COVID epidemic, which we will do. Um, also, we don't look at certain questions where most of we been get already for ask. So thank you very much, Dr. Kamara. Um, what are they can do now? They can unmute um, some of the people that are waiting at the panel and get ready for una for ask any questions we una go get so now be me one minute to a, a big word on mute people if you get any question where you want type you can type them um, and please the tool get functionality where you can able issue and up uh, them um the recording they back on anybody they want to ask question we will see people he hello um yes hello hi hello everybody um, Hello. I'm in a, I'm in a Hello. Hello. here. Yeah. Hello. Sorry, I'm late at the beginning. I'm good. Thanks. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'd love to ask Fatima about um, nutrition because um, I'm, I work as a pharmacist and I work in GP practice land. I see a lot of people that where they advise on healthy lifestyle because I manage a hypertension diabetes always in Doctor Dokova. I help manage them with medicines. Alhamdulillah. But um, I'd like to know when it comes to we food out for tailor we own food to a healthier life, you know, healthier lifestyle, balanced, well-balanced diet. I would really love for, you know, see if you can give me guidance on that. We still want for it to palm oil a bit. We still want for fry with stew and all that a bit. But no one just moved to Mediterranean or Japanese diet altogether, completely. So I can want to tell people, like, okay, I can tell me, but they then wouldn't come in. Well, so you, sister, they tell me, say, I don't eat me fufu anymore. So we <laughs> want for let to say, we tell around, let it fit to people. But at the same time, we're still healthy and we look after ourselves. Thank you. Thank you, no very problem. Uh, thank you very much for that question. Um, yeah, it's it's uh, it's it's very difficult um, for for us um, when we move to abroad uh, in the West to to keep a balanced diet. I think in the sense that we don't need to necessarily shun our own food, but at the same time we need to be wary of the quantities that we're eating of our own food. Now, I gave a, a talk about COVID nineteen and nutrition last time. And I think the most important message that I think people should have taken from what I said is that you need to make sure that you eat a varied amount of food. So when you're eating your plastic, add some vegetables. When you're eating your fufu, don't put, pack the whole pot 
with fufu and eat the whole pot from the the, the, the portion that you put in the pot you put on your plate that is what causes a lot of you know resistance and, and when you're eating too much of starch that causes diabetes because of the blood glucose is not um, able to be regulated again you know so for me i feel like the most important thing is understanding what foods you need to limit so obviously we don't have a lot of nutritionists in the community that um i've, I've studied all this all of this but um it, it's it's now becoming more important for us africans to understand how our food impacts our health not necessarily oh we're eating too much palm oil that's what's making us you know fat no it's more about limiting and having a good balanced diet and varied diet as uh, even uncle has, has mentioned uh, everyone keeps banging on about this uh, balanced diet but literally is the key um of, of any diet the mediterranean mediterranean sorry diet is um is, is advised because it's very balanced they eat a variety of foods. They don't stick to just rice. They don't stick to just you know a certain, certain uh, um, food and be fun with it. That's that's the main problem. So of course, um, in in my next session, I'll be talking in more detail about um the foods that we're eating that contribute to cardiovascular disease and how to limit those or alter them or change them to suit our our diet, not necessarily for you to then you know just disregard your own diet and go for a Mediterranean diet, but more about balancing the both. I hope that answers your question. Ajami? Yes, that's yeah, thank you very much. Yeah, that's that's helpful. So yeah, just limit what we're already eating. Yeah, because yeah. I know so we, we're very difficult for low yes. move on to new things sometimes. So yeah. yeah. Thank exactly. you. Exactly. Thank you. Which I go do as well, like Fatima say no more. We don't cover um a session on this, on the type of food and way people have for eat and how you know the portion and stuff like that. What I go do, I go put the link, um, the YouTube link, I go put it in the chat so you can I can go, I can go look um, um after the show. Also, if I want to see all the other shows that we don't do over the past couple of weeks, we get about five sessions already on YouTube. So if you go on YouTube and just type S L O G M, that's S for Sierra, L for Lima. O for Oscar, G for Golf, and M for Mike. If you type that on YouTube, it will come up. You will see the logo. If you click on that logo, they all the session they will don't do. They all did it did as a playlist, so you can able to go through them one you know one. Um, session at a time. The first one was an introductory session where we explained within the session they are wanting you know, all these initiative they about. The second one I've been Dr. Kamal and I've been Gi regarding COVID-19. Then the next one I've been Fatima. Then after that, we do, if we don't know about number two mental health sessions, one have been um, generalized um, anxiety yeah, yeah. disorder, yeah. and the other one, when I be last week, I've been sleep problems. So we they do more sessions. And the next one will be on nutrition, nutrition and cardiovascular diseases. Am I right, Fatima? Yeah, and, and yeah, so, specific for uh, BME. Yes, so then they now go to do next week, but I go, a flag will come out, we will publicize them as we can normally do. So I go advise people them do uh, um if we can go back and just look on some of the old sessions. Yes, maybe the recording might not be as professional as on TV, but um the message is to okay. Thank you very much, Auntie Ami. Um you. anybody else want to ask question? I'll just look if anybody hand it up. Anybody want to ask any question? Okay, while while we wait for people to ask anybody there within the panel, we want to add to it if Fatima don't advise so far. Um when I good evening everybody, Mina Rugi. Obviously. Yeah. Yes, ma. Go ahead. Yes. Um, obviously, um just for self, Dr. Kamala, thank you for in, in presentation, then Fatima self don't add. You know, now everything when they don't talk so everything cover a lot of things the way we all for sort of be aware of where you come with diet and the we health and everything so for we we just they try for sort of encourage people them let them let them follow them then small 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 simple simple um advice as well in the gig so that um we will live a longer life well body pass better pass gently so it's good for like people and um if they listen if then if they get doubt, they don't understand. Then they come back to we really and ask Dr. Kamala. They all Monday for answer question. We go for book and for you back if you if it's something that you miss or you go go back you go go on the Facebook or the or YouTube for let you able for get the for listening to the to the lectures them or so that um, you said we gain something out of it. 
Thank you, ma. I'm also as soon as see me, I didn't have a bad dad in today. Um, and they get me on vitamin D. <laughs> so um <laughs> yeah um i don't know if anybody else gets any further question um if you video not the owner not going to see you so you may you go need for use the virtual um for easy and up um yes okay anybody else okay there's a question here Okay, um, the question is why make um, people from the BAME background are more at risk of COVID? I guess that's Nana, mm -hmm. Nana from uh, Mr. Prince Shaka. So, um, Dr. Kamara, you be able to shed some light on that for me, for me, please? Yeah, well, the, the BAME community they more at risk because now we they work seven days a week, and mm -hmm. the more you work, yeah, the more likely you get run down, the more likely mm -hmm. the immune system definitely be deficient. There's no questions about that. Now, as you see with my them, <laughs> before you matter, you don't go one uh, have one week leave or something, you can't. You know I mean? That's the mm -hmm. most the immune system. No questions about that. Now, we get Boku large family them. We they, mm -hmm. now they host them, we crowding day too much. All right? And this thing, as I say, now droplet, now in the, 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 the transact them, if you like, or man, they, they, they pass them around. So the more people them, you know, you get like eight, ten people them inside two bedrooms. Clearly, the likelihood for jamming to one another is high. Now we mm. get them low skill the jobs and now we get them low paid jobs. You know what I mean? Mm. We get extended families them. And of course we diet as we know, we also responsible. So all in all, we get genetics, we get social, we get economic, and all of that they point against me. There's no truth about it. I mean I can amplify, I can talk as much as I want, but I can tell you say we they more at risk because for one, now we go there, we get uh, them free clinic there. Like for example, I don't know how most people then don't check their eye at the age of 40 against glaucoma. Mm. For example, yeah. mm. many mm. people don't have like they say at the age of 40, every black person is supposed to go check your eye to mm. see whether the blood the, 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 the expression of the eye don't go up or not. Mm. Glaucoma, mm. We get well man claims that we need to thrive because of that. As I say, we need to go. Because what you do is think I say, ah, you know, go up into me. Like somebody tell me, say, why don't tell me, bang, bang. I don't smoke myself. I don't eat. This thing will take me down. You know what I mean? Those who work so much say, why don't take me? I can't just eat. Nine that. Ah, this is not the dish now. Belle, sir. You know, in the dish now, belle, now the nose, the back of the throat, and to the lungs. So if you go take your agbeche, well, just the ambogi said because now the belle, now it's just the warm. But it's not the warm because at all. And but of course, if you gargle in the morning. You gargle in your neck, you know, you blow your nose, you understand, wash your hands properly, clearly you could be less uh, 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 likely to be infected. So we depend people and clearly, genetically, and obviously the other one that we did more at risk. Mm. And also something I want to touch um, light on as well today, we me and Mr. Uh, Dr. Kamasi this morning. Now also this exercise. Um, some man feels in the past they go to a gym or past they go to a park yeah. for the able exercise. There are so many simple exercises that we can do now also. We, you know, if we go on YouTube, there are different, different, simple, simple exercises we bring into. So I will go back to the audience. Anybody else, they will get any question for me? Not all men are they able to see, so I'm not able to see if for somebody raising hand. And they try for see as many people. So if anybody want to raise hand, please do. Um, if you feel, say, you know what, ask, so I can, they can shame the public. Um, I can ask one question. Mm -hmm. Yes, ma, go ahead, ma. Let me, let me talk to you. Yes, ma'am. No, 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 no. Okay. <laughs> um, Dr. Kamara, even though I know you mean a part of the panel, um, I want to ask this question because it's a general question. What do you make with foot and swell, especially around the ankle, and how we go do for stop this swelling from happening? When you put the ankle, the ankle is swollen, the foot is swollen, and get boku boku in them. Uh, you get to actually find out because, believe you me, so on tablet, then they will take one of the side effects, nah, you know, uh, we then call them pedal edema. So somebody way like this, we know say we took most of the uh, hypertension. And uh, they don't find out, say, when they give uh, one great tablet for control of hypertension, I think we get the pharmacy, pharmacy somebody will correct me if I'm wrong. Uh, 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 they find out, say, if they give one grain uh, anti-hypertensive, you know, by work from black man, so they get for add another one. Band. Now, I know I'm not the pain, absolutely notorious for leg swelling. A demon are one of the one notorious side effects we get. You understand? And again, if you get low protein in the body, the leg can swell. You know what I mean? If you do work out too much, the leg can swell. There's a lot of things we can cause the leg can swell. So either it be cardiac or renal, renal kidney, or maybe just functional, or 
maybe I had to get equipment and say, now, doctor, which one thank you. So I don't fall category in line to make it as well. Because if you walk out two, three miles a day, four miles a day, clearly the leg is well. No question about that. Of course, if you get heart trouble, you must get legs well and that's not part of the, the symptomatology world again, you know, the symptoms. You know, and of course the kick itself again, it can cause retention of fluid, and of course the tablet will be taking cause retention of fluid. I think that Namex or man can deal on water tablet will reduce the swelling if you get heart failure. You know, if you man get some kidney failure, then obviously they look for gear and that, then they go from gear on one particular water tablet where they protect the potassium. Because if you, if you take one way, they pull all the potassium, sodium, and all that, the person will see the person will end up with another problem. So they get forget that happy balance. But then they, now a subject of, you know, if you want to you talk about that, we can take that on board and then research and bring that come on. Thank you, sir. Okay. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Yeah, the next person I will go to, um, you're not getting name, you just see iPad 109, but you see them by um, um, a cabinet. Thank you. I don't unmute you. If you unmute yourself now, if you're able to talk, sir. There you this go. This one, today, my name is Ro Lashite for that one. Oh, look at that. My bro. <laughs> How are you, sir? How are you, sir? <laughs> This is a very powerful thing you guys are doing. I so appreciate you for being invited by my brother, Mohammed. And Thank I will say much, that it's a very good thing because this is very vital. You know, money is one thing, but health is good. So we want to sacrifice on our selflessly the app for educate we. I appreciate you so, 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 so much. So I just call for say thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Let me keep for do this. Let me keep myself together. I appreciate all the contributors then and make we not stop all because this is selfless giving is important that as you give, you shall receive. So I appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you. I'm um, going to go to Auntie Amina, then I'll go to somebody else in your text report. Auntie Amina, if you unmute yourself, please. Thank you very much, um, brother. I, I don't know your name, but um, I, what I want to do, because I joined late and I not ever joined on that, I've been just wondering a little bit more about on that. So would I, where would I find that? Do you have a website or, I don't know, um, maybe it's too much to take time now for later, maybe a bit more about on that. But I really appreciate our doctor. Is it Kam Kamara? Thank you very much as well for the talk. I enjoyed it and everybody else in contribution so far. I think it's a good initiative, something I was thinking about myself, but me not London me based. I see, I understand in Manchester and I do, I don't know. But yeah. anyway, I just like a bit more background of you guys and I'd like to join you proactively because I'm there on my own mission. Fantastic. I'd love to work with you. So that's oh, lovely. That's brilliant. That would be great. That's brilliant. You're welcome. welcome. If you send me if you send me an email. I go okay. email you back and provide you all the details. Then also take you through the background, what we don't do, Please. how far we don't come, and which now we plan going forward. I will sort all of the out for you. I will share the email back once more before we finish. I'll type them on soon. Thank you. All right. Fantastic. Thanks. Thank all you very right. much. Thank you. Thank okay. you. Um, right. there, there's a question here. It says, please clarify further for those with a chronic condition, example, heart condition, diabetes, or well, comorbidity. Yeah. Come on. <laughs> so how high or low are the chances of surviving COVID-19? Uh, yeah, um, okay, thank you for the question. Now, obviously somebody will get, um, if you like, predated um, problems with the heart, you know, heart complaint and all that, uh, and uh, diabetes as well as hypertension. Clearly, most of we get high, hypertension and diabetes, obviously they are at a higher risk of a heart attack, if you like. You know, and possibly we get a uh, heart condition as well on top of that. Clearly, now, like a uh, uh, disease, it, uh, do, double trouble, whatever it is, uh, two God, two, two trouble, one God kind of thing. You know, uh, obviously, it increases your chances of uh, getting the COVID. But I can guarantee you now, you know, necessarily means say because you don't catch the sick and because you get into it, it means you go die of harm. I want this to be clear. I don't see, I tell you, I think people that we can bear witness, they were, that one, the very first patient who I deal with, we get COVID. I so pleased for announcement, I said, then discharge and did for yesterday. Oh, lovely. Yeah. It's so good. I remember that case. case. I remember yeah. that case. Yeah. I yeah. Come, yeah. I come on the 28th of March. <laughs> yeah. He did intensive care. He can forget, try to mm -hmm. me and things and all that. Yeah. He actually survived. People that they will not get what he get, he actually uh, outlived them. Because this man, uh, I know I've been telling him, but anyway, I know get his name and I know, but he's been the weight more than 180 kilograms. He's hypertensive, 
Yeah. Mm -hmm. At the same time, you di get diabetes. At the same time, of course, now you sit in time bomb to get a, a, a heart attack. But believe you or not, well, the joke we cracked with me before he left. He said, "I tell you what, uh, can ask me for weight loss. I go tell you, say go catch COVID." <laughs> Because he's not on his coat. It was a crude joke, but obviously he answered the question. See, I tell you what, as long as you control this thing, you're able to do what you're supposed to do. The likelihood of you dying from this thing, not even worse than somebody will not get up. Because what you do, they get this thing they call cytokine storm. I mean, uh, 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 Ms. Dialogue will actually bear me witness because it's not an unusual reaction to this virus. We know to all man get them. It's a bit like when people get meningitis. Not to all man will die from America, but sepsis itself, it can become so bad. It, it, it's so quick. You understand? Know, unusual reaction. So, as it were, somebody will get them. If he shields himself, he eats well, he controls it, they do exercise well, and this, that, taking tablets and that. It's not likely it means he will die before the person will not get them. Obviously, you're there at a higher risk, but that doesn't mean you will die from it. You can definitely survive it. I don't see people who will survive it. The colleagues they will not get negative. Then die, one day we then get, they not get, they not survive. So this is a new thing we all they learn from. Look like that picking itself. Then we feel say, they know they get the sick. But now we don't find out say we get this thing they call pediatric, you know, inf inf inflammatory multi-system uh, uh, syndrome. Hims they call it. You understand? Because until them they check the picking them. So nobody know no, how much picking them get this thing or not get it. And they likely say they get them. Most of the way they die so now they actually connected to this thing they call. Kawasaki disease, you know, we get for do with all the arteries and all that. So it just goes to show you. Now, I don't mean say because you get this sick, it means say you will die of a more. Obviously, it is higher because what you do that you get two or three. But if you protect yourself and do what you get for do and control this thing, and of course, no go go spread this thing in blah blah, the likelihood say you will survive. And no question about that. Thank you very much, sir. I hope that they answer your question. I'm um, the next person I go to now, Mr. Lansford, right? I don't unmute you, sir. If you unmute yourself. Is that right? I don't know what's happened with your volume. You need to come through. We need to hear you. Is that right? I see you they talk, but I need to hear you. I don't want to meet you, sir. Now, please tell me there. Okay. Okay. All right. Well, I'll meet you for last. Maybe you'll be able to sort out your phone. I'll come back to you. I'll not put you on. I'll come back to you. Okay, there's somebody else. Um, Techno Phantom Nine. Um, the, the lady, you get um, Colly Colly here. Uh, is you say you have from now from Fritzon and because yes, in Umo. Okay, last if I keep on mute him. I don't try for mute you. Oh, they're not Fritzon, not Fritzon. It is so. Mm. Well, the same message should I make you right if you're able? Okay, uh, right. now I'll go back to Mr. Wright. <laughs> Uh, Mr. Wright? I we didn't see what they move, but we didn't hear you. Okay. Um okay, let's see. Um Fatima Bangura, Brahma Bangura. Okay. Anybody else do we get any question for us? Yeah, I get question for us. Me and Brahma Bangura. Yes, sir. How are you, sir? Hey, uh, no bad. Uh, yes, go ahead, sir. I'm very happy for this um, session. You know. I know, know my question is that, I mean, since, I mean, um, um, this uh, coronavirus, this COVID-19, you understand, one way or the other, it affects the mental health of all of us, you understand, we all, you understand. Yes. My yes. question is, my question is that, why is it that, although part of the question, I think Dr. Biyasa, but, I mean, not to hold the answer, you understand? Why is it that, I mean, um, we the blacks and the Asians, you understand, are four times more likely to get forget this um, coronavirus, uh, I mean, for, 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 uh, for this uh, sick for affect them, than we white counterparts, you understand? But not only in two countries then, in Britain and the United States, but in other countries like Italy, uh, Germany, and other, in nobody, in nobody the same. Why? Now, this I want to know. I don't know if the question go through. Mm. Yes, sir. Thank you very much, sir. We get your question. The, the, so question, come on. Is, yeah, the question is, you say, we four times, we the BAME representative them, four times more likely for case to see? No, we the blacks. We black ethnic minority, we the Asians then. Yeah, that's it. BAME. Yeah, it is a, um, basically, um, now UK and America, 
be yeah, yeah, exactly. higher compared to yes. other um, other advanced countries. Them why? No, for with the blacks, for with the blacks and Asians. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Is there any reason for that? Is there any explanation for that? Well, I mean, I, I, I don't give most of the reason why I don't give under just now. As it is, as I say, we get genetic, you know, predisposition. We we actually we uh, because of the lack of vitamin D. We're more likely for KPC than we don't know find out scientifically. As I say, now, 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 me in the hospital, all the black and ethnic minority uh, doctor, them, we don't move to the medical director and say, we want, let them prescribe vitamin D for we, even without doing the test. That's not the only way we will be assured that we will protect yourself. You know, so we're likely for KPC because we do do the melanin way that the skin is higher than we counterpart the way that the wheat mother. If you watch, which man then wait and go out, then go go then born quick, you know, then the body then get this time then come. That just tells you that by, by the time they come, the melanin don't go off because it will actually brown the skin. Whereas we now we don't need them. So clearly, as they say, because we don't need them, clearly you know they get them for penetrate the skin and then we need to get the vitamin D with a natural skin where they grow. Because it's low, we more likely for picture. Secondly, as I say. We get thin the way they from the body way now genetic is you know displacement we make we more likely for picture. Thirdly, as I say, now we go exhaust myself. We go walk so many days of the week. You understand? Mm -hmm. So then as I say, so man go walk two, three walk. Let's imagine mm -hmm. that. Twenty-four mm -hmm. hours of the day, you don't mm -hmm. walk away each one at eight, eight hours, that's sixteen hours. So then you mm -hmm. take one hour for go from one to the other, that's the eighteen hours. Yeah? Mm -hmm. so you left with that much. By the time you reach the house and tell you want to continue, you, know, you undo you unwind and all that, you don't look at 20 hours, you don't go down four mm -hmm. hours. Next thing mm -hmm. you have to grab back country. And as you do it repeatedly, that's so the body they get tired, and so the immune system they weak. When I make you find out something, then they went to happen, boom. The mango don't walk only here, the next year, it's like go be lost as alone. Boom. Mm -hmm. so they, they, they don't get you know problem with the heart, you don't get problem mm -hmm. with the lungs, you don't get problem with the, the bowels, you know, then continue it. Clearly, we did more at risk because now we did they pay less. You see what I mean? Mm -hmm. I, as we say, you know, even the spiritually, if you look at the Quran, they tell you say, Allah create the, 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 the day for let you make you living and he create the net for you to make you rest. You see what I mean? As yeah. I say, now we days are also you get sick, sick people. You know? Really, if you place tight, the likelihood of the person to want to be like too hard. You know? And of course, you know, you get the other problem where you say, then they pay me less. So you get to work more hours to let you able to yeah. for, for make up uh, the, 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 the deficit where you get. Then for send for people in back home. You know, all of that combined together, not rest, yes. not yes. eat well, yeah. not sleep, get anxiety, get uh, other condition that uh, we know, we definitely be more at risk. Thank you very much, sir. Um, the lady will get the collie collie here. I want to go back to you. I see you they ask about how for put uh, I think you phone no freeze as well. You hear me? Yeah, if you um, yeah, you can ask a question. Yes, now. Yes, Andy. Oh, you, now you are the asshole now. You don't need to raise your hand again. Are they hearing you now? Yeah, Hello, ma. Yeah, okay. okay. And the network. Uh, yeah, you go look, you look at it. Well, la, la, look for yeah, me. Yeah, right. I want to do. <laughs> yeah. Yes, go ahead, ma. I don't freeze back. Now the network. Yeah, then so I'm a typing question. I go to mm -hmm. a typing question. Okay, let's look for Mr. Right. Mr. Right, yeah, and the I don't mute you, sir. Mr. Right. Okay, thank you very much. Ah, perfect, perfect, perfect. <laughs> okay. <laughs> How are you, sir? Uh, <laughs> thank you very much, and I gladly for joining us. Thank, thank you. Hello man. to Dr. Kamaya and the rest of the team. Thank you. You know, I really, really appreciate this because it's so good and this is very timely because uh, we need more information, you know, around COVID-19. So many information they go around. We they read all kinds of things on the internet, social media. So sometimes you get confused and say, what's really the happy body sick? All kind of theories and stuff, but it good to get people like now we also help for let we I could say for let we able for like get the correct information them and make good decisions them. Now two questions I want for ask. One now around the food business. Um, the nutrition is been talk something about the food business. Now in Sierra Leone, you know, within Astalonia, we varieties they're not too plenty. Maybe like all at once again. So with our knowledge of the food that we come on a salon, 
term the like this, waiting at the best thing for it, for people, uh, for boost their immune system and then kind of stuff. Then the second one now around, um, we find out say people them not look the die plenty in a salon. And um, today I get an opportunity for going at the treatment center. And we go for go do some, you know, some media coverage there for like we able for like. Hello. You don't need. Right. Communicate with the We find out that we get a couple of white people them um, with there in the treatment center. Yeah. We of course need to see. But um, the black man in the plenty. But we find out, say, the older people, um, the aged one, them, now they seem for they in critical condition. Mm. The younger one, them, they look fairly okay because the, the way out and do the ward, then get the one the way you go take and say, now, like uh, the um, intensive care, them, it did by level. And then you get the one the way a little bit mild. So, but in the West, like America and, and, and England, for me, it's doc self been explained. The minority then seem for they be affected more. You get more black men than a Michigan and other places than we die. But to we now, it's like say, I don't know what's in the reason. If we immune system different or is stronger, how do you explain that? We make the resistance or whatever, it look a little bit strong. And we get a good number of people and we, in salon now, things don't separate them. You want the way it's symptomatic. They get a care center within the care they go. Then the one that we really get acute symptoms then, then they go to the treatment center. But the one that we asymptomatic, they are a problem right now. Then they deny say they're not get sick. Then they argue the doctor them. Then they make plaban at the place. Sometimes it's so difficult for containing them. The psychosocial people and can try, but it's difficult. So just want to like just understand some of them and they don't if I can just help with. Let me understand how this thing they work. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, sir. Would I want to go for okay. Um, okay. The first question uh, for uh, Fatima. Um, yes. Yeah, so, get session again. Okay. Anyway, don't do more that. But if you just touch base on that, just on a high level, just give them an overview, please. Yes. I go can't talk the crew because now it's a low man when they talk to me. <laughs> 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 when I be here with me, or when I be here, when I be here. But um, thank you for you um, for the question. But what can I want to say? Um, what you don't say? Uh, the food in the salon, okay, when I not get variety, then they not true. But where we don't look and research na the food, where when they eat in the salon, like crane crane, uh, uh, okra, potato leaf, it gets beaucoup vitamin then where uh, beaucoup food them na the West not get. So if when I look at okra, okra gets beaucoup vitamin C. Vitamin C is one of the most important ones them, where them they say gets linked with COVID, where they help um, for strengthening your immune system. So now when you they say why people them now the West think they die more per uh, COVID-19, the way uh, Uncle Doc don't, uh, um, they don't tell you now, uh, he said the immune system is na, na something where they take part for them. So if you look at the food way on they eat, na ya, in the food way we they eat, na ya, and which kind uh, um, uh, condition where we they suffer with, na ya, where people that are not they suffer, for example, uh, cardiovascular disease, uh, high blood pressure, we are not the suffering. Why? Sometimes because if you live in an upline, you're able to work more, you're able to do something, you're exercise more. Where you they look for people that they eat in Africa, they get portion than where they eat. They know they, book, they, don't know they eat past what they get. They know they work. Yeah, they know they eat. Exactly. Okay, so, okay. so if you they eat the correct portion, then they, all the food where well, they eat get the correct nutrients. One food, one African food don't get five nutrients. It gets vitamin K, it gets vitamin A, it gets vitamin C. Normal, the number one way you the lack pan, where even at the food that now the West no get on, now vitamin D because vitamin D you therefore get on uh, from the sun. So if you not get them from the sun, you know they're able for your body you know they're able for make and in itself. So even if you they eat eggs, then say egg, egg, egg yolk gets beaucoup vitamin D. Even if you they eat then the, the quantity of vitamin D where then at the egg yolk, no beaucoup. So you therefore get sun. Where sun sun go make the vitamin D uh, to produce. So then they I they say that maybe now one 
concept where I can put out the day for, for Una for saying, and I make maybe sometimes people then are alone, not they die for cool for the COVID 19, but people then are abroad and they die more because we get diabetes, we get uh, cardiovascular disease, we get all them things, and the way they make we more at risk for, for die for the, the, the disease. So when I continue for eat the food, then we on again because they tell you say one food, African food, don't get all the nutrients we on need, but when I know say already the you therefore uh, 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 eat and proportionately no no more than this. So I hope say you the answer your question. Thank you very much. For well, also add to that, as part of the session we be doing, there are lands here as well. Some of you they overcook with food. Mm. Yeah. Well and too much. Yeah. Well and yeah. you don't kill all the nutrients, but you tell you actually put an update that is not left again. So yeah. there are um, I will say there are, I will encourage people them. If you go on YouTube, you type slum S L O G M. If you just type them on the search. If you search, you will see the badge, the logo. If you click on that logo, they will give you a list of all the other sessions they wouldn't do. The nutrition, the nutrition session will be a very good one. I will encourage mm -hmm. you to have a look. Okay. Um, so you see, we we'll have one. Let doctor answer the next question. Then I will come to members of the. Okay. Now, well, now I just finish, no man. I just, I just want for both of us to and Fatima this day because now the West here, but we get McDonald's, we get KFC. Yeah. We don't fat, then at that ten day, I blood pressure will not be getting that day, it don't come. Diabetes mm -hmm. don't be getting that day because of the different things all day because yes, so now uh, free for all. You get for buy them, but it's cheap. And the food they want they make when they give it for let me eat so all full of chemicals. Una we then a salon truly. Una blessed for like una get them kind of food and then yeah. a salon. Una eat them in all in, in limited, but it very very good compared mm -hmm. to what you will eat now. Yeah. So so una continue with waiting and the vitamin D. It did it for una plenty mm -hmm. the sun. We don't have much of it here, so na make go for take supplement. You don't need the supplement because the sun is out there for you. Thank you very much, man. Yeah. Thank you very much. So doc, I will come over to you now for let answer the second part of the question. Let me just expand on that need on a lame doc now for finish off that need. Okay. You okay? Yeah. Yes, I just want to expand small more within uh, both um, uh, Fatima and Rugi say. And obviously the uh, learning to the question uh Brahma Bangura asks, say we make you know, we black people uh, especially Woody, like America and England, you know, they die more compared to the one we did uh, some part like Italy and other side of Europe. Obviously, if you look at the, the, the social factors, then mostly social factors, we now get a chance to get jobs, even in a low paid jobs, then we we'll still get a chance to get them. Why is that a part of the country? They're not getting a good season there. They don't get at all. Mm -hmm. one big mm -hmm. factor that yes. Because if you yes. go in that, say, for every man say, it open a McDonald's. Now, a privileged job, friend. Now, a privileged job, say, it open a McDonald's. So, then, factor, then they all play, play a role. Because, yeah, yeah, if you see that, that's side of the way black man, even if we no side of the way go in the black man, no side, no side, even a low pay job, but no side of the way they go in the black man. But if you go to the other side of Europe, I mean, if it's a security job, a privileged job for some man, they under. So, there's mm -hmm. that factor, they might play a role who make the, 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 the people where they die in England and America, the more pass like other time in Europe. Because they overwork work, they they over work themselves in it. Yes, the and another fact, another social thing. fact, and we might, we might result to that. It's a sad thing for say, but if I will go to you for talking, you know, we get them meet the new belief, say, I know that I'm a black man, making black man. Yeah. So even like we come for doing jobs there, the PP is the only provide for we. So my way they get blue, even though if you all in company they get red, you know, they ask question or no, because they're yeah. blue, you just want to go. Indeed. You understand? You know, they ask, oh, Indeed. you make me get blue, this sort of person get red. You know, they check. You know, just get confidence. Ah, uh, do and for yes, it's nice like a passion for the job what they do. But as much as the same time, try to protect yourself as well. You know, as much as get passion for what you want to do, you know, ready for sacrifice and then sign you for a life for but yes, protect yourself. Okay. You know, yes, you. protect yourself. Yeah, so, so, um, so, so. Mr. Mr. Sister, if I can if I can take her from there, just as you okay. say, with regards to the PPE. Um, mm. especially we were the work now the care setting, where they go work, and Dr. Mm. Bidon mentioned that. When you they put the gloves on and the way where they take the gloves off. Now, one of the main way down the way they say they catch this COVID. They catch COVID, yes. But people do not really understand this. Most of these people in America, they are all carers. And when they go to the care setting, the PPE way they use, because some people can use one PPE, they take her from one room to the next room, especially this COVID period. 
So it just happens, say, if you the work, you don't have the care setting, you the work, you and your family life matter. Where you come out work, and just say everything where you wear, from head mm -hmm. to foot, left arm straight inside the washing machine, you left your shoes in the door, then you go take a hot bath. That alone, they kill the COVID or any virus where you take from work. Make sure, say, where you they take your glove off, you take her off the right way. Make sure, say, the glove not touch the other hand. And wash your hand for 20 seconds, just as Doc say. Now, that let me get to out to this. Thank you very much, uh, Miss yeah. Shaka. Um, I go, my family and children are here. Um, Doc, I hope so you don't forget the second question. Because mm -hmm. some of our me, don't already forget that. But yeah, yeah. Um, I will still let you come in for the second question. Then you go answer, Mr. Wright. Yeah, thank you very much, Mr. Wright. Yeah, and uh, grateful for seeing you on board. And uh, clearly, Naden can see now the hope for safe whenever we get the, you know, uh, uh, expansion we will like, and then the recognition we'll get as far and as wide as possible. And as I say, yeah, unfortunately, this, this seek not to seek where you can say, I catch and today, I no say I get and today. As we all know, they don't tell me this, uh, dip, you know, repeatedly, dip, you know, different things. Say, look, the incubation period now 14 to 21 days. So imagine you say you don't expose yourself to this virus. You can't get for know whether you not get them or you go seek or not seek until 14 days. In that time, there's a lot we can happen. As I can say, one day in a long time in politics, never mind 14 days in a person's life. So, if you miss the opportunity for lock the country, yeah, you can't know how this thing will affect the country until another three weeks lapse by. Mm -hmm. So, I remember the first interview I do, it just coincided with the government in decision for impose the state of emergency. And that lockdown, now that is absolutely vital for protect the country as a whole. Now we all the talk, I'm saying we miss the opportunity today in the UK. Uh, mm -hmm. want, they want to do anything, that's fine, but we miss the opportunity because we know about this. And waiting them the time for do now that herd immunity. So imagine say Una don't lock the country in time. At the same time, the food they want to eat, when I not get them big, big portion then. Mm -hmm. At the same time, when they eat the right food where they boost to immunity. At the same time, we not get that sedentary lifestyle. We are very active. There's that. We not get no chance or no place not even for making put on weight for develop blood pressure, for develop diabetes and things like that. So clearly, one way or the other, then factor are all the even out. You see what I mean? So one way or the other, one they even out with the other. You see, mm. as opposed to we own where we they are sedentary lifestyle, obesity, stress now walk. Yeah, mm. anxiety levels, the wrong diet, you understand? Because some man, if they walk in the net, they leave mm. you me. If you walk in the net, you they eat in the net, you they put on weight, you know, if you know, so you put on weight. Indeed, indeed. You, understand? you disrupt your circadian rhythm as they call them, where you for walk in the morning, you rest in the net. Clearly, if they abog you, they make you put on weight and they make the pressure go up. So, you see what I mean? All that, and then they hormone them, this cortisol and this, and all that. And of course, you go for the work or support you under. So, one way or the other, we definitely they suffer more than yeah, and now we go there, we ignore. Then they mm -hmm. will not even get access to doctor. You go for mm -hmm. being somebody really, you know, uh, affluent with somebody who money get treatment for you for food for most for most doctors. So clearly, if you get the proper food, you cook and you wait for cooker, you exercise as you did, you rest as you should, yeah. And at the same time, you lock the country and take the measures like I see when they do, and so when they put the uh, 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 the, 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 the the mask them on, clearly. The likelihood of uh, the rate of infection for be equal to waiting we get my eye, very, very slim. Because Una get time for take their order than they. So man go deny. Yes, you expect that. Then conspiracy theory, they will get them. Every time to happy. I mean, they tell me mm -hmm. you go back. They're not tasting a weapon, a biochemical weapon and all that. Look how we people and die. You know what I mean? You know, but that's not the problem we'll get. And as I said, the most difficult <coughs> barrier for bring down in any public setting or any scientific setting, that, that acceptance. Lack of clients that the most important when I tell you all, you must go people because of lack of affordability. If you say, ah, we get a lack go smoke myself, lack go take bangba, we take shake with me. Well, bangba shake with me for that, you know. Yeah, this is not for the virus, this is the malaria thing. You tell me, just like how somebody go tell you, say, I can take uh, chloroquine, we will not say for malaria, I take it for take up for COVID, you know. I then can't you declare all the rules for those two people? So, do yeah, let me listen to the one that we don't deal with this sick. And obviously, with that, we go save more lives. With not that, we go perish. But as I say, the good thing for this sake, 
Now, only 2 to 3% mortality. The people who go die, out of 100, now 2 or 3 go die. If, I, if not the other sick, the way they die, 40, 60%. Clearly, in a different thing they talk to. But the important for those who say, factor then they wait in as alone, we will not get Naya. And I make some time, we know. Besides that, we are lock in time. So within three weeks, we the team for actually spiral out of control, when I don't get under control. I don't mm. that answer the question. Thank you very much, Doc. Um, I also get a question when I a bit off topic, but I'm um, not from Salonic Commot. Um, the person they asked me in with uh, which they call thyroid. Okay. Thyroid, well, thyroid now, nah, separate topic from this one we did today. Thyroid, as I've been touching them slightly, right? So, you know, the that thing way they the front now, they call it the thyroid gland. You get uh, two, if you are, but it, it looks like butterfly. That's what it's time. It's shaped like a butterfly, you know. Obviously, depending on if they produce then their hormone yeah, when uh, substances with the for me, for the for control the body in temperature, in metabolism, and how they go about and doing this. You know, if it's too low, you get what we call underactive thyroid. If it's too high, you get overactive thyroid. And each and every one of them, then they get immune symptom. If you they you they sweat past mark, you know, and of course. Uh, your body begins to tremble for you. And for let you drink one cup of tea no more, ah, you begin to sweat like say the 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 free water for you. Your body begins to tremble. So man can get diarrhea with that. You understand? So man can the uh, in eye begin push out. You know, like when they say body eye. You know what I mean? Then sometimes the thing that the neck begins swell and call and that gets. You know, because sometimes outside the day, the soil way the way the the area outside the vegetable that they grow, it lack iodine. And because they lack iodine, they are not there that the, the product that we they eat, but well, they actually um, use them for develop and produce this thyroxine when the hormone now in the thyroid gland they produce. So if you know if you produce them, you get bigger again. You understand? If you will produce too much of them, then obviously the eye and the intolerance to, to heat, you understand, will come on. And then they get to your problem there. In fact, the underactive thyroid can lead to things like depression, problems with menstruation, uh, fertility and all that, you know, the anemia and all that. But, but then in a separate session, we will deal with But well, clearly the thyroid, na, na, na gland where they control the metabolism. And so then the day, na just a small viral infection, na can trigger that thing day. And call them Hashimoto's thyroiditis, inflammation of the thyroid. You know, another thing we can affect the thyroid, na the, the thing that we, na, we can call thyroid cancer. And get four types. As I say, I can talk about those if you want, but I don't think so this is the right session for that. We will take on board that, and if you want, you can dedicate a, a, a session to all the uh, uh, hormonal uh, uh, organs, you know, the thyroid, the, 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 the pancreas, uh, the, the kidney, you know, the suprarenal gland, you know, and all that, and they put them together and talk about them. If you're not happy with that, we can do that. That's no problem. But the thyroid yeah. is a special subject we uh, obviously will make you vulnerable, but not necessarily will make you die from the COVID. Okay, yeah, we'll go look into that. <laughs> um, but thank you very much. Some of the name that we call, you know, I will just stick to Gegen at Wood. I'm sure, I'm sure everybody agreed to that, Andy. Okay, um, um, we get another question. He say if somebody be don't care, if somebody be don't get um, COVID before, waiting at the chance is sick to catch him for the second term, and if he could catch him, you know, if he gave for catch him back. Is more likely in, in percentage higher or lower compared to somebody who not been on ketchup before. So now a two two in one question. Yeah. Well, as I say, this is a new a new thing. Nobody no go tell you say we know for certain hundred percent say if you don't catch up before you don't go catch up again. That I can tell you that not the God's honest truth because we don't know much about this. But what we do we in the scientific field we always can actually reflect and compare uh, like for like. So when you look at the other one, the will be known the SARS virus, the MERS virus, even the flu virus, na part of this year. You know, this COVID-19, what they talk about, it belongs to the family of uh, this uh, COVID uh, coronavirus. And we made them call it corona because you get that crown panel. If you look at them, you will see you get the crown. I made them corona. So we don't know six in the world. You get four types, then we then call the alpha, beta, gamma, and delta. The alpha one, then they give you this flu, who they get to. And then the beta one, and the you then SARS virus and the MERS virus and the uh, the other one then. So clearly this COVID-19 falls under the beta one. The beta one is dangerous. You know? So as we know, 
the flu, you can get it repeatedly. It can come on and off, on and off. Now, I make you the way old that you need for less and get protection. But just look at it. I can give you a similar example. First, you will not one day leave Nasalona or Africa. The immune system against malaria na zero because what you do, the body no don't get exposed to malaria parasite, the, the plasmodium. First in way they leave alone all the time, the immune, immune system very high in terms of resistance to the malaria virus if you take the preventative measures. And possibly we don't leave alone, we know day day now, you get some amount of immunity because if you don't leave day. I don't know if you ever forget the analogy. So it yes. means if you don't get the virus and you get antibody in the, in, the, in the blood, clearly you get some amount of immunity. Because we don't know how long this immunity will last, I can't tell you. But normally, with the expected, it will last between 6 to 12 months. Even with the Ebola, if you don't catch them for a whole year, then guarantee you, you don't go catch them again. So with the hope, say, this, and so it will be like this one because of previous experience. So if you get six months uh, protection or one, one year protection, clearly you're far better than possibly will not be ever exposed to them. I don't know if that answered the question. Yes, that name definitely that name definitely makes sense. Um, let's see if any more questions there on the pipeline. Okay. All right, guys, um, because of time, I know this sub these subjects, by the amount of questions we don't get, they don't prove very, very popular with the people then. Um, guys, we day as well every week, the same time, every week, every Saturday, when I come on board, um, um, we'll get a different topic for talk to on our board. If we get any question where you're not able to answer, you know, you're not able to ask today, or maybe you don't get the right answer, um, please send them by email. I don't send the email in the chat, so please send them by email. We we'll answer you directly, but also to you we go do. We can take the question if you're not personal, if not to a personal question, we know we we'll identify you. Obviously, we'll get for be mindful of GDPR and DPA. Um, we can be take the question, put the answer as well in the public, in the public domain, so that other people themselves could benefit from them. So for kind of round up, what I go see, I will go through my panel and um, ask for let everybody give their final word. Do you have a big we would on the online already for a very long time. People in back and as much as they enjoy the session, they say one would do something. So I would say do you are lock keep and don't tap maybe 50, 50 seconds. So they are low round up. So I would say I'll go with Sisigu give force, please, ma. Make sure yeah, the last um, one we were left to people. For me now for just say um for say thank you to everybody no more for because of the questions them, then the the session very lively, very interactive. So just for say thank you to Ms. Um, the topics them as well. Thank you very much, ma. Next person I'll go with Mr. Sisi. Yeah, I, mean, I, just a quick one, I mean, I tell everybody thank you. I tell everybody thank you for coming. And we need more questions. They obviously done the push me more, you know, for yeah. prepare ourselves for able answer on that. And we are we are big, don't not tune in. Because now that make good there, we are big, don't not tune in. Thank you very much. Thank you, sir. Um and say, sir. Um, just give us a thanks to everybody for all that I'm joining me today. And very good question. The audience was very good. The only other message where they say, please keep safe, wash your hands for 20 seconds at all times. Thank you all for joining us today. Thank you very much, Ma. Um, Fatima, to you, Ma. Yeah. Uh, just uh, thank you um, for Uncle uh, Dr. Kamar for sharing this important information. Uh, I'm sure it's answered a lot of um, worries that a lot of people had in the community in regards to COVID-19 and how dangerous it is um, for them as they're vulnerable. Um, but um, just thank you for everyone for tuning in. I say just spread the word as much as possible mm. um, that more people can, can you know, benefit from this session. That, that's all. Thank, thank you. Thank you very much. I hope you're not anxious. It's your turn next week. And <laughs> <laughs> Doctor, you're next, sir. Uh, which yeah, you yeah, go yeah, tell yeah, people? Yeah, yeah. Which yeah, you go tell people for round up? Yeah, massive thank you to everybody for listening in, especially my alumni, my Britain uh, fumble them, and everybody. Uh, a huge, huge thank you to the team, especially with Wizard. We without them, we're nowhere. Actually, you know. Yeah. A, a big, big hooray to Ram. Definitely. Like the man. <laughs> yeah, a big shout out to Ram, you know. <laughs> uh, and this one doesn't have to do with modesty because I'll tell you what, it takes a lot of hard work for putting this thing together. So, mm -hmm. you can see soon, I just the, the swan in back, 
they, they swim nicely, and they, 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 but the under under the under walk inside that that pond, they then put the do the work with clearly this man now he take the full brunt of it. So a huge thank you to them. We bow down, bow down to knowledge and you know and support clearly. So I thank you all, one and all. Well, this, as I say, is just the tip of the iceberg. So we now spread the word, you know, wide and high, and so that people can go benefit. As I say, I always say, I'm if you save one life. The equal, like what you don't save the whole of humanity, and equally, if you destroy one life, you know, unlawfully, and clearly, equal to where you don't destroy humanity. So, that that we do for when God give you this opportunity for make day together, He clearly he give you the knowledge, the technology, and the know how we need for actually play with your role. And as I say, this thing uh, for let we people and benefit from them, you know, who knows until we go extend them to other languages, and you never know, yeah. And all that, it just you know, see, way and that's way very, very important for those people. I should begin so. We they expect for Lord to give you feedback so that we'll be able to make this thing grow in a way we will go benefit from them, we'll pick them, we'll pick them and all the members of the family. So I thank you all for our audience and I'm really, really grateful to everybody. God bless the mass alone, God bless you all, and let God continue for to join you all. Thank you so much. Thank you very much, sir. Thank you. For saying we 